Hey guys, it's the Battle Productions, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Y. In the last episode, we got ourselves Jet, otherwise known as our Squirtle. And in this episode, we're going to be going to this cafe in this new town. So, yes, we're going to be going this way, I think. Yes, that is right. And I think we turn left here. Hiya, this way, please. Welcome, trainer. I haven't I seen you around here before. This is your first time welcome to the video studio. Oh, here we go. I'm um, sure I'll try it. Um, energetic, cool, fun. Let's do cool. I didn't mean to go in here, but whatever. Okay, stand right there for me. Oh, yes, that's it exactly. You are so cool right now. I think I might just freeze. Great, good job. On the shoot today. I think this will be a great video. Huh. What is this great video? Here I go! Meet Michael! Okay, I didn't think I did that right there, but whatever! <laughs> okay, that works. Um... Sure! Uh, yeah! That was so awesome! What's this? Over here. This is where you can change your look a bit and be ready for shooting your trainer PR video. Okay, no, I don't want a little touch-up. No thanks. Oh boy, I didn't mean to go into the movie studio. Oh well. Let's talk to Serena here. Hey Gam, check it out! You can- Okay, yeah, 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 I know, PR videos. I already went through it! Goodbye. So we're gonna be going this way. This must have been it. Huh? Have you been to the cafe already? No. Where's the cafe? I have no clue where the cafe is. Um, let's see. No, not in there! Ugh. It's the worst thing about the skating is sometimes it's hard to control. Alright, let's see. Is this... I think this is the Pokemon Center. Yeah, that's the Pokemon Center. PR Video Studio. Audio Guide. Hmm. Oh, the cafe must be right here. Um, yeah, here we are, right here. Could you come here for a second? What, is she want to break her love to me or something? Oh, isn't that Lisandre and Diantha? Just so you know, neighbors, just so you know, neighbor, Lysandre is the head of the Lysandre Labs, which created the Holocaster, a video messaging device. You know what Diantha is? She's one of the most famous movie stars in the world, after all. I wonder what two of them are doing together. You played a young girl so wonderfully in your debut on the silver screen. Wouldn't you remain? Would you rather remain young and beautiful forever if you want to play such roles? That's a strange question. I don't want to play the same roles forever. Youth may be beautiful, but it's not all there is to life. Everything changes. I want to live and change like that too. So I look forward for playing different roles as I get older. You were chosen to be a movie star, correct? Isn't it your duty to be ever beautiful? Everything beautiful should stay away forever. I would end the world in an instant so that beauty never fades. I can't stand the thought of the world becoming uglier. Oh, jeez. Oh, hello, Michael. This is Diantha, one of the most accomplished movie stars in Kalos. She moves the multitudes with her excellent acting, which is to say, she delicates her life to making other people happy. Oh, Delicates, dedicates, sorry. Oh, if ev only everyone were like her, what a beautiful role would this be? So, if you excuse me. And who are you two? My name is Serena, and this is Michael, right? I heard Lazandre call you that. You both have lovely names. Oh, you're both trainers. Don't your Pokemon look happy? I'm a trainer myself. I, in my off time, I look forward to us battling someday. Huh. Guess if you're a Pokemon trainer, you battle everyone no matter who they are. Well, that's right. I have something to ask you, Neighbor. Will you be able to compete with me to see which one of us has become stronger? Um, sure. Bring it! What? I guess you're a Pokemon trainer if you battle everyone no matter who you are. I don't know. Whatever. She doesn't want to talk. Whatever. Let's talk to this person. I heard Lysandre's gathering young people for society's sake. Okay, whatever. 
she wants to battle or something, and I don't know why she's not allowing me to battle her, but whatever. Let's move this away. Hollow clip received. So, check this out. I'm on Route 5 right now. I'm just hoping hop wild Pokemon. Hurry, come check it out. Um, okay. Oh, that's so hard to control. <laughs> All right. What the heck? Hey! Nice to meet you, friend. They call me Mr. Bonding. Oh, so you're sort of like James Bond. Have you ever heard of the O powers? The expression of yours tummies you haven't. Don't worry, I'll tell you all about it. O powers are mysterious forces that have all kinds of useful effects. They make your Pokemon stronger or even help you get more money. Any friends with you nearby also benefit from them. They truly are mysterious powers. Get starting, shall we? It's bonding time. And you received an O power from Mr. Bonding. Now you can use attack power and defense power. Attack power increases attack stat, defense power increases the defense stat. That's not all, the powers can gain levels the more you use them. Take a look at the instructions if you want more. You can activate the O power using PSS. Huh. I, mean, I wonder what that is. I don't know. I don't think I need it for the main game, so it really doesn't matter. Okay, Route 5, Versant Road, and whoa! Lucario. Car! Wait! Lucario! Hey, about that, are you okay? I was looking for some special train by Lucario all of a sudden, it dashed off. Hey Lucario, what's going on with you? Did you get drawn in this boy's aura by sp or something? Car. Well, it seems like Lucario likes you. Thanks. See, Lucario can pe read people's auras. I guess that's something in your aura that makes it okay liking a stranger. This Lucario is always getting worked up at, with, in battle with my other one. Maybe it's just waiting for a trainer to appear who's strong enough to challenge it. I'm sorry, I was such on a hard, such on a roll. I forgot to even introduce myself. I'm Karina, the Shaolor City gy Gym Leader. If you're collecting gym badges, I'm sure we'll be battling sooner or later. I'm looking forward to it. I hope you know how to roll with the punches. Alright. It looks like we have our first double battle here. People say we're like two peas in a pod. They say that we're two halves of a hole. Alright, that, that sounds really bad. But okay, we got twins Faith and Joy with a mining and plusle. Go, Ashleep and Buskin. Okay, let's go for a Vine Whip on the Plusle and a Ember on the Minin. Helping Hand, excellent. It's a quick attack here. Whatever, they didn't really do much. And wow, that took that really well. Alright, got some speed boost here. Okay, let's go for a Vine Up on the Minin and Ember on the Plusle. Okay, just keep attacking Asha Leaf, that's okay. That's perfectly fine. Okay, Kimboss can go to level 19. And Electra Mouse grew to level 10. Try to learn Quick Attack. I guess Growl. I guess, because I don't use Growl and I'll probably never use this anyways, but you never know. Quackle grew to level 12. Okay. It looks like Asha Leaf grew to level 18. And Jet grew to level 11. Fletchling grew to level 13. I'm trying to learn agility. Uh, I guess it's better than Growl. So I guess I'll do that. And we defeat Faith and Joy. Okay. I'm gonna put Jet up top. Just because I need to get Jet some experience. There we go. Let's see. Um, let's just start running here. Uh, is there anything in here really worth it? Oh, look at that. Maybe we can jump up here somehow? Maybe there's a railing we can get up to or something? I don't know. Yeah, there's like these little railings. Maybe when we get our bicycle, we can do that. Like in the acro bike. That's probably what it's like. 
Okay, trainer ch tips. There are some buttons that come in handy. For example, press the Y button to let you use register items and stuff like that. I'm gonna be running. Oh, look at that. My goodness. Pokemon hordes are certainly intense. Yeah, they're made up some like dance team made of Pokemon, aren't they? Oh, Tierno. Do you ever think about anything besides dancing? Nope. Even during Pokemon battles, I'm always checking out their moves. My, then my hip, my feet just start moving, and then too, you know, I just can't help it, you know. Yeah, yeah, too. I did, I did like that swords dance. I love it. That's why I can never win. Oh. Oh, hey, Big M. Do you have? Do you know any sweet moves? Show me in the battle. All right. Looks like we gotta battle our Tierno. He has one Pokemon, Corfish. So let's go, Jet. It's level 12. Well, that doesn't matter. I'm gonna tell it. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, that did a lot. Oh, it was a crit. That's why. You suck, game. Okay, I need to get a payback crit. Come on, give it to me, or not. Okay, Vice Grip better not get another crit. Okay. Um, I am going to switch. That was definitely a dumb idea. Let's go, Ashleaf. Let's go for Swords Dance. Excellent. So, is he dancing right now to Swords Dance? I bet he is. But uh, I'm just going to go for the Vine Whip, and that's just going to take him out. There we go. Jet grew to level 12. Okay, Electra Mouse grew to level 11. We defeat Tierno. Oh, that was some nice footwork. And we got 1,200 for winning. Good to see you, Michael. I, excuse me, I mean Big M. It definitely does seem as tough as Tierno. Could he only think about dancing his move? What a horde of a Pokemon popped out and he just stood there watching him. Well, yeah, Trev's just coming up with the world's best Pokemon dance is my dream, after all. I was born to dance. I won't ever stop. Not with the moves like this. That's indeed a perfect dream for you, Tierno. I guess I shall just show just as much dedication to my dream of completing the Pokedex then. It's good to be serious about some things. Uh, Big M, do take this honey, won't you? Sure. You see, using honey will encourage Pokemon hordes to appear. Though if you're going to challenge a whole horde, you might want to use moves that can hit multiple targets. Oh, so you're just trying to make me die and white out. Whatever, you are a jerk. Okay, I'm gonna use up my potions. Okay. And let's see, is there anything over here? No, there isn't. So let's keep moving on here. Oh, there's a trainer. I haven't been able to sleep very well for days. I don't know if I'm up for a battle. Your challenge with Rising Star, Hamish. And he has a Kadabra. Ooh. That's threatening. And that's level 13. It doesn't evolve until level 16. Oh, well. What? It has confusion? He doesn't learn that until level 16! No! Oh! Ugh. Game! Way to screw me over, game! Ugh, game. You suck. It's using Kinesis, excellent. So now my accuracy is lowered. Alright, um, let's bite him. That should be the end of this. There we go, because that's so bad of defenses. And now I should leave through to level 19. And then Jet grew to level 13. Trying to learn Bubble. Even though it's useless compared to Water Gun, but I guess... Well, it does have lower defense. I mean, I don't really need Tail Whip. I mean, Withdraw could actually be useful since it... As of right now, it'd be useful. But, eh. Kimbuskin grew to level 20. Quacklin's level 13. And it's trying to learn Knock Off. No, I don't need Knock Off. I'm not even going to use this thing anyways. And we defeat Hamish. I knew it. I really got to get some sleep. Uh, okay, let's see. 
let's use a super potion to heal up Jet. Oh, okay, no, I, never mind, I can't go up there. Um, what else is there? Is there anything else? Okay, there's another skater. Okay, there's a bunch of skaters. What's over here? Okay, there's... The rules of a Pokemon battle are simple. You see, rule one, battle. Rule two, win. We got ourselves a roller skater flooring right here with a doe duo. Go, Jet. Here we go. This is a wetter, better matched battle. I'm going to go for the water gun. Okay, wow, we took that really well. Water gun should probably do at least a quarter. Oh, yeah. It's trying to use Rage. And it's gonna build its Rage! Alright. Whatever. Whoa! That did a lot. I think I have the Torrent ability with Jet. Which also could be very useful. Fletchling grew to level 14. Stop it! You followed the rules perfectly. Yeah, I know, because I'm, I'm that awesome. Alright, let's see. Super Potion. And here's another battle. I'm working on some synchronized tricks with my Pokemon, but we can't get our timing right. Let me practice against you. Alright, so it looks like this may be a psychic person that has psychic Pokemon. Oh no, it just has Bunnelby. Go, Jet! Let's see, let's go for a water gun. I think I'll be good here. What? No! Okay, I'm just gonna tap it. There we go. Water gun! Okay, now it's going for Leer. Maybe I can get Jet to evolve this episode. Maybe. Well, actually, it's almost the end of the episode. I mean, 17 minutes. I'll probably go about 20 minutes in the end of the episode. Oh, it depends on how far I get. Alright. So, it looks like it's Skidoo. Uh, I think I know what that is. I th I'm gonna go to Kimboskin. Seems familiar. So, I'm gonna go to Kimboskin. Yes, that's what I thought. Yeah, this go go pre evolution. So let's just use Ember. That should take it out. Okay, Electra Mouse, screw level 12. We defeat Winnie. Gah! Okay, I'm gonna s let's just switch to running. Let's see, what's over here? Okay, Wild Encounter, excellent. And we got a Furfru! I don't know what the typing is for this Pokemon. Um, let's try catching it though. Cause it went for Sand Attack, that sucks. No, I missed! Oh, come on, no, Jet, we're not starting off here. Baby doll eyes. Oh, great. It's gonna tackle. Okay. Critical? Nope. Okay, I'm gonna throw a great ball at this thing. Alright, let's go! One, two, three, and we got it! I wanna see what the typing is for this thing. And we also got experience. Quacklin, stop leveling up! It is a normal type? Yeah, that's right. The Poodle Pokemon. 3 foot 11. 67 point, uh, no, 61.7 pounds. Historically in the Kalos region, this, these Pokemon were designed guardians of the king. Alright, that's interesting. Thought maybe it'd be like a normal dark kind of Pokemon. That'd be cool. But, guess not. So as long as I'm with my Pokemon, I get to meet all sorts of people from all over the world and train and battle with them. 
Okay, looks like we got Tyson here with a B do. Yeah, B do. Let's go, Jet. Okay, we did less than half. Okay, attack fell. That's okay. B Doof is actually a pretty bulky Pokemon, so I can see why it's taking it really well. Defense curl. Okay, that's fine with me. It's not gonna do anything. So, all right, let's go. Water gun. That should have taken out. Yes, it does. And B Doof is down. And Jet's level 15. Now it's time for Ordish! No, Oddish. Okay. Let's go to Kimbuskin. Yeah, Kimbuskin's level 20. This thing's becoming so overpowered. Let's see. Ember. There we go. Kimbuskin's level 21. Trying to learn Sand Attack, no thank you. And there we go. Oh, Fletchling! Uh, that thing keeps leveling up. Stop leveling up, Fletchling. I don't care about you. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, wow, there's an electrician here? Nope. I see our seasoned traveler. I bet you're good at battling, too. Oh, yeah, this guy's a traveler. A backpacker. With a centret. You know, I kind of like that sprite there. Okay, let's see. Let's go for a water gun. And it hit right in the target. Right in the chest. And hopefully we can get to the, level, the range where we can get the torrent range. Okay, I think we'll get torrent range here. Yeah, that's torrent range. So that will definitely take down the centret. There we go. You're just as good as I thought. And we got 500 Poké Dollars. All right. Are we almost to the next town? Oh my gosh. How much is there left? Oh look, a Pancham. This Pokemon's really interesting. I was thinking about putting it on my team. Just because of the fact that, I don't know, I right when I saw it, I'm like, oh, this thing has to be a good Pokemon when it evolves. So I'll go for a bubble. Okay. So I don't know, I may consider putting this on my team as of right now. I'm not 100% sure. Let's just throw a Pokeball at it. And just have just go from there. I just won't nickname it, because we'll probably go a name raider raid, uh, later, and I'll change all my names anyways. Because I don't like the names I gave all my Pokemon so far. So eventually when we get there, we'll change the names. So alright, there we go. I think I'll end off the episode here, because it's getting a little too long. So yeah, Pancham, a playful- oh, it's a fighting type? Ah, uh, okay, I don't think I should have a fighting type on this team, never mind. I mean, I already have Combuskin, so I guess I won't use him. Alright, so I guess I'll end off the episode here. So if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, favorite, comment, subscribe, and shout out in the inbox, and see you guys next time for some more Pokemon Y.